Hollywood is getting ready to make a movie about a Lynchburg war hero. The story of Desmond Doss is one of bravery, courage, and the ability to stand for what you believe in. Yeah, now nearly 70 years after his heroic actions, movie producers are preparing rather to tell the story of Lynchburg's conscientious objector. Dave Walls is live in Lynchburg tonight at the school named after him with more details on this project. Dave? Well, Len and Noreen, the story of Desmond Doss continues to inspire generations here at the school that bears his name. And now some big Hollywood names are hoping to inspire the world with Doss's story. The story of Lynchburg native Desmond T. Doss is a fascinating one. It's a story Principal Stephen Doss, unrelated, loves to tell. He was, just, he was just a man of faith. He lived and breathed his story his whole life. In April 1942, Desmond Doss was drafted into the Army. There was one problem, however. Doss refused to pick up a weapon and left the Army with no other choice but to label him the conscientious objector. In interviews conducted prior to his death in 2006, Doss explains his commitment to his religious beliefs left him with no other choice. I want to be like Christ. I was saving life instead of taking life, and that's the reason I take up medicine. As a medic, Private Doss carried no weapon, yet still walked into battle to help his wounded and fallen brethren. In 1945, he helped rescue 75 men surrounded by Japanese soldiers. That heroism would earn him the Medal of Honor, the first ever given to an objector. Humbled to the end, Doss would downplay his role. You hear 75 now, and they say, one, but when they initially did it, they told him 150, and he said, oh, no, no, there's no way it was 150. So he so downplayed they, it. Oh, yeah, so he downplayed wow. it. Years later, Desmond Doss would make several visits to the school, talking about the war and inspiring the next generation. According to Variety magazine, a big-budget Hollywood film about the life of Doss is close to being in the works, with Mel Gibson slated to direct. Stephen Doss says the kind of life Desmond lived is the kind that can inspire the world. He practiced what he preached in every way. I, I envy that kind of faith. I strive to get to that type of faith. Variety reports that Andrew Garfield from the Social Network and the Spider-Man movies is lined up to play the role of Desmond Doss in that movie. Principal Stephen Doss here at the school says he's had discussions with people affiliated with the script and he knows that it'll do justice to the legacy that Doss has left behind. Live in Lynchburg, Dave Walls, ABC 13 News. All right, an interesting story indeed. Thanks, Dave.